All right, now the the signature solo of this. I'm gonna when I say play it, boy. I'm gonna let the bass string ring. Open E on the sixth string. So it's open E, fretted G sharp on the same string. Walk up, fretted B on the sixth string. D fret it, E fret it, D, B, A, open E. Now we're going to transition to the four. Let the A ring on the fifth string, and then our rhythm kicks in again. verses and now we're going to go into that chorus I'm using a the simple uh, based on the first position C add seven moving it up here till we have an E and just I'm not pressing now so that I get some of this uh, it'd be kind of like a open G sort of that rings out, which kind of emphasizes our pentatonic tones there, the blues tones. And every time I'm going to strum, I squeeze it. And that lets a lot of sounds drone out there, and that fills up the sound, because you don't have a bass and guitar behind you, or bass and drums be, <coughs> excuse me, behind you. Now change to the four going to use the same fingering and just go up one string and down to get the four. So same fingering just up a set of strings. And slide up. Now the five, same thing. Same fingering, just move it down one. Then, as you do that outro, as, as you're ending the song, you know, one more time, what I say, all that, we're going to change this four to a ninth. Up here at the twelfth fret, we have an A ninth. <clears throat> and what this is, is a textbook chord that looks something like this. I have a hard time fingering it, as I've got short stubby fingers. This finger was cut off and reattached so um, it's not that important to me to learn this chord because I can do it by cheating a little bit. And I'm going to do it down here where I can reach around the neck a little better. I'm grabbing the, if in this case it's going to be a C. Here's our C root note. So pick the fret of the root note we're going to bar <coughs> excuse me the first th three strings the index finger is going to bar the fourth string down now if i'm trying to get or need the whole chord need from the bass to the top string my thumb is going to wrap over and grab the sixth and the fifth string there i got the the whole thing there <clears throat> now you would see Hendrix play it that way and for him it was because he had fingers like this long and he could so why not so if I'm having to play up the neck and I've got kind of kind of a wide neck here and I don't have the fingers for the wide neck I'll, I'll just leave the thumb off and emphasize the high notes if I'm looking for the high higher tones if I need the bassier notes try and squeeze my thumb around and emphasize the thumb and I'm not doing it very well right now in slow motion. So anyway.
Hope that helped. Thank you.